get to go help Heather and Alan because their cat is actually stopping Heather from making her living. No joke at all. She's violent. Stop. She Stop. lets you know very loudly, do not come any closer or else. <laughs> oh, she just totally just clawed my hand. I wonder what makes this cat so mean. Better go find out what it is. I'm Heather. I'm Alan, and we met at a gym. Dated for eight years. And recently married in May. I'm a Pilates instructor and work from home. And I'm a personal trainer. I work at the gym. Our relationship is great. But the one thing we fight over is Ruby. Ruby. I teach Pilates in my living room, and I have to get the cat and put her in the bedroom so I can do my job. Every morning, I have to chase her around the house and get her to go into the bedroom, and she attacks me all the time. I am terrified of Ruby. She draws blood. And I'm afraid she's gonna attack one of my clients. They might get the cat out. <laughs> and there's no possible way that I can even hold her. <coughs> Ruby and me fight every day, and it's brutal. <coughs> and usually she wins. <coughs> we adopted Ruby from a shelter, and she has hated me from the beginning. I think Ruby was abused by the other people that owned her. And I think it was a woman. And that's the reason why she likes men ow, ow, and not stop. women. And she loves Alan. Yeah, she's kind to me. I can pet her, I can lift her, and she bites and scratches Heather. And it's always been like that. Alan's funny. He, he treats her like a, a princess. <laughs> Guilty. <laughs> Alan doesn't realize how bad it is. You know what the actually the worst thing that she's done is that she made us fight. Because it's us arguing about what to do with her. I just really want Ruby to love me. I feel like I'm being rejected all the time. We did all the tests with the vet, and he was like, you know, she's just a little. And that was when he first gave us Prozac. I am not a believer in the Prozac. So we stop that. We might not know it right now, but there's, there's another way. 